Guys, when you're peeling corn, don't get rid of the corn silk. This is a very good diuretic. It's great for bladder infections as well. As with all these teas, if you have any issues, uh, any health issues, please ask your doctor before you take any of them. Um, on side effect for this would be if you're allergic to corn, obviously, please don't drink this tea. And also if you have low blood pressure, it is a diuretic, so it can lower the pota your potassium. So again, ask your doctor. But if you don't have any issues like that, this is great. I used to take it all the time when I was pregnant because I'd get so bloated, my hands, I couldn't wear rings, my feet, no shoes, <laughs> you know? I'm one of those pregnant people and I would have a cup of corn silk tea and it would help me. Also, as I said, it's very good for your bladder when you have a UTI, you know, to help you um, clean things out. If you want to keep these fresh, put them in a bag, seal it, and put it in the fridge. It'll last you for a few days uh, before it gets all, uh, you know, like this, grimy or whatever, slimy. But if you want to have it all year round, just simply dry it, put it on a pan, you know, spread it out on a, on a baking sheet and dry it out and then keep it in your pantry and you'll have it for as long as you want. All right, let's make a tea with our corn syrup. So I'm putting about this quantity into a pitcher. And I'm gonna add about a cup, cup and a half of water. This is boiling water, guys. We're gonna cover it and let it steep for about five minutes. Okay. You can sweeten this if you want. I don't sweeten my drinks, but you can put a little honey in here or stevia or whatever you want. And, you know, enjoy up to two cups a day. You can do it hot or you can do it cold, you know, room temperature. Mm. <sighs> Reminds me of my pregnancies. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to see you soon.